We'll get a ball up. Punched away. Gained some territory. Call going for number one. That kick was pure. He's enjoying every... They get it. Back in the middle now. Goldstein got in the better position. Cunnington kicks hurriedly. Patton brings it out of the pack. Marshall wins the marking contest. Slams it on the boot. Finds it in motion. With a driving kick. Ball out of bounds on the wing. Toss back into play. Goldstein clears the contest. Membry doesn't get low enough and gives away the free. Gets onto the kick. It's cut off by Bonner. Quickly onto the boot. Handballs. He has the ball. Mark Botting. This will have to be his very best kick to score from this far. It's a big kick, and it goes straight through. His teammates rush over. That's the first goal for Tim Kilda. About to resume hostilities. Goldstein gets it down. Anderson will be the recipient of the... Goes by foot. Zeebel with a chance if he can keep his cool. It's a huge kick, and it goes all the way. Celebrating hard. The Roos kept the lead by a kick. Umpire ready to resume play. Won it down. He gains possession. Marks all alone. Finds himself in space and marks. It's a foot race to get this one. Steele comes in to level the scores. That's a big goal. What an effort. Gets some reward for his efforts. We're all tied up. We're back in motion. Big thump from Goldstein. Cunnington going to be penalised here. Marks. 40 metres out. Should be relatively straightforward from here. He takes the shot. The kick towards goal. Congratulations. Centre bounce. Thump by Goldstein. He gets his hands on the footy. Just a moment. The Roos only trailing by less than a goal. The ball ends up going to ground. Trailed by four. Clark to bring it back into play. Plays on. Uses it by foot. Missed the target. Gresham sees off Zeebel. First possession for Young. Gets the handball away. Gets around the imaginary opponent. Moves it by foot. Couldn't quite with the mark. Hits the target by hand. Court links up with a chance to run. Doing well was Larky. Bends off the tackler. A drop part through the goals. Huntington puts his first goal. Umpire ready to resume play. Thump clear. The ball in the hands of Cunnington. No issues with that drop part. Back with another centre bounce. Wins the ruck duel. Is in his possession. The long driving goal from Goldstein. The umpire set the bounce to restart the game. Cunnington with the ball. No prior. Ball up in the centre square. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? 
It's a really entertaining game of football. One quarter down and three to go. Plenty of football still to be played. The scores are the Ruse 32, St Kilda 18. The Ruse could have come out and started well and shown they have what it takes. The coach will be asking for more of the same for the rest of this one. Well, we're out of the block. Here's Gaz to break. Ready to go for the second turn. We're back in motion. Goldstein thumps it. Reload the attack now. Wilkie drives the kick. 34 leading the race to the loose ball. Receives the handball and takes off. Intercepted. Right in. It's in a good position. Got boot to ball. Membry finding it in motion. Decides to kick. Corbis around it. He needed to mark it. And he did. He runs it over the line. King missed the target. Ball tossed back in. Right in. Dug it out. He heads for home. <laughs> McKay with the responsibility of kicking it in. Picked up by Clark. Lynch goes by hand. Zerha gives it off. And now they go. That ball comes off the post. Looking to bring it back into play. A race for the loose ball. Higgins manages to get past. Higgins just Goldstein with a chance to line up for goal. Just hits the post and a minor score. Wilkie to kick it in. Just gets it onto the boot. McDonald, wrap best. This is Higgins. A great goal. Celebrate. Back in the middle now. Right, it's up to clear. He's got the football now. Gets it out of congestion. Opportunity now for Butler. 45 metres out. This shot should be elementary from here. He takes aim. The kick towards goal. He acknowledges the crowd. Work needs to be a bit better. Too many of their hit outs are getting sharked by the opposition. Doing well to intercept that kick. McKay elects to kick. The ball goes over the boundary near the 50. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? This is a classic game we're seeing right now. Davies Junior gets onto the ball. Young wants to keep it moving by hand. Made the tricky bounce look easy. They get around him. Back in the middle as the rucks go at it. Goldstein got a fist to it. Fighting hard was Greenwood. A chance to reload the attack now. The rooms just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Good mark and looks to send it back. Good on. He drives it towards goal. That one rounds off the post. The rooms lead by 16. Considering the options on the kicking, 34 plays it to himself. Works the ball up the ground. King drops the mark, just gets the kick away. He heads for home. It's going to be close. Hall delivers with a straight drop cut. He's about to resume hostilities. Goldstein hurls it away. Slick with the hands. He wins possession with the ball now. On its way. Lynch wouldn't be happy. Centre bounce. 
clears the contest. A bit too hard with a push, and it's a free kick. Goes with the kick. Ends up turning it over. Kick by Young. A solid mark from Zerha. The rules are allowing the opposition uncontested marks, but they sit up behind the ball so well it forces the opposition to play that style. A mark by Hill. The siren sounds, and that's the end of the term. Let's see what the stats... Players back on the field to begin the second half here. Back in the middle to resume play. Goldstein thumps it forward. Rides out the tackle. Zebul needs a chance to rest. Larky missed an opportunity to mark. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Yeah, he's having a real quiet... Ranking points. The opposition need to get a hold of him. Kick connects with the post. Wilkie looking for options now. Great mark in the pack. He's a long way from home, but he might have the wheels. Darts it through for another. They are starting golf. We resume hostilities. Guided down nicely by Goldstein. Up for grabs for Ryder. Marshall wins the foot race. Kick on the way. And unsure of their next move. Zerha missed an opportunity to mark. Well picked up. Zerha just threw it. A long driving kick ends up turning this ball over. He drives it. Walker found some space and marked. Uses it now. Marks now and can send it back. Moves the ball by foot. Cunnington turns a free kick. Gets it away. Takes on the space. The handball now from Walker. Bonner gets on the end of that handball. The loose ball scooped up. Quick handball. The handball hits the target. Has it now. Puts it on the boot. Stevenson couldn't snaffle it. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Well, he hasn't had the impact we were expecting. And it's across the line from behind. The rules have actually turned it over more than the opposition, but they haven't allowed that to translate into scores. It's why they're still in front. A desperately needed goal here. Looking to bring it back into play. McKay plays on. Looks up with a kick. A strong pack mark. McDonald tucks it into the pocket. Finds this one all by himself. The rooms have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. Larky didn't mark it. Phoenix takes the pressure of the goal kick upon himself. Moving on. Going for goal number one. Phoenix. Back in the middle now. Ryder aims for his man on the ground. Manufactures the handball. Gives it to Billings. He's able to ride it home from a long way. St Kilda. Congratulated, folks. Centre bounce. Swatson. Davies Juniak comes away with the ball. 
drop cut straight through the middle. This kick stretches. This about to resume play. One down by Ryder. Pushes through with power. Billings a bit too casual with the tackle. Stevenson gives it to the player running past. He gives it a ride. Looks okay with the first. The Roos doing well. Looking for options now. Plays on from the kick in. McKenzie got the hands free. With the ball is 34. Rushes with the kick. Nice hands. Higgins to have the shot from outside 50. A long effort at goal, and it goes all the way. Higgins getting the room. The leading by 32 as we go to the final turn. The rooms will want to. Here's Gary to take a look at the key stats. St Kilda giving themselves a chance on the turnover. But... Umpire ready to begin the last turn. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. With the ball now. King got hands to it. Oh, the umpire calls for it. What can you tell us, Gas? I'd really love it if these teams took the contest to the next level. Runs it over the boundary line. The ball is coming back into play. Punches at full stride, receives the handball. Zebul is streaming past and gets the footy. He's got the footy in his hands. Can't quite sneak through, and only of a 33. Wilkie unsure of the next move. Plays on, puts boot to ball. He wins the ball in the air. The distance might be just beyond him. They're doing really well to choose some time off the clock here. He goes for broke. The kick towards goal. We're back in the middle to resume play. Hammers it. Hanabry with the ball. Looks for a target inside 50. Steady hands there as he holds that one. 20 metres from home. No angle to worry about for King. Using every ounce of energy he has left. back in this one but there is time the rooms are taking advantage of their upman's ability it gives them first use at the stoppages and forcing the opposition to defend takes a simple grab 65 meters out Zerhak with the opportunity at goal 45 degree angle looks like the ball will be coming back the rooms haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal but i'm not sure that it's the forward spot Ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning title that way. He might kick a goal on its way. Into the post it goes. The Roos league is now 34. Zebel looks to get onto the football. Hanabry handballs. And now Gresham right up on the ball. And Kilda now only trail by 33. Takes a strong mark. Webster a long way out. Three for points, simply unable to take that opportunity. Consolation weighing up the options now. Decides to play on. McKay goes with the kick. Does well to cut off the kick. The kick from Howard. Stevenson couldn't hang onto the ball. Higgins just put it on the boot. Coughed up by McKenzie. Couldn't get the hamper. Doing well was Goldstein. Keeps it moving. Quick hands, and they could be away here. Goes through from behind. Players move as they look to provide an option. Wilkie puts it on the boot. Drops the mark. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? I'm waiting for something to change the way this game is going right now. 
Hanabry dishes it off, slams it onto the boot. Marshall hangs onto that one. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. The ruse forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Goldstein has resources out wide. Power looking a bit sluggish out there. Ball gets cut off. Giving it off was Cannington. Hands that ball to the opposition. It's a behind. The Saints behind by 20. McKay unsure of the next move. Goldstein looking to track down the footy. Got hands to it. Hall contests the hard ball. He delivers with a drop. We're back in motion. Right in. with the punch. Sinclair hacking it out of there. King takes a strong mark. Distance no issue. It's all about the accuracy. He looks like he needs a spell. No issues with that drop punch. That's his... The Ruse put another win in the books. Final scores are 88 to 74. Thanks to Gary Lyon for joining us. We'll see you all later. It's been a pleasure, Hutto, and we'll catch you.